In this week's We Will Update, we're going to talk about the County Council. Brave states are opening up. Will we ever make it to Phase 3? And We Will has an event for you this weekend. Are you sick of the lockdowns? Are you ready for Phase 3? Are you wondering what they are? Then this week's We Will Update is for you. On February 23rd, proposed in the budget was the requested authorization for a county executive to enter into a contract between Whatcom County Department of Health to implement a COVID-19 social marketing campaign plan and messaging platform in the amount of $200,000 this passed. What messaging is going to the public? Can we trust that they're spending the money correctly? Can we trust that they're spending the money on educating us on COVID-19 and that these facts are accurate? Also, some members of the council do not think it's necessary to allow the public to share their screen during public comment. Currently, Bellingham City Council allows people to share their screen during public comment. Some members of the county council don't think that they can accommodate this. Why can't the, count the county council make this accommodation to its constituents during these times of online only hearings and meetings? We would like you to encourage to write your county council members and share your thoughts. Would you like them to be able to share your screen? Would you like them to see your face? Would you like to be able to see their face while you are sharing your concerns? Please write to them and let them know. For more updates from County Council member Tyler Bird and Ben Allenboss, you can tune in to my edition of Saturday Morning Live in the link below. Now news from the governor. Thursday, announced a pause on regions moving backward in the state's Healthy Washington Roadmap to Recovery Plan, meaning the entire state will remain in phase two on the phase two plan for now. We're making this pause in recognition for the fact that we've made the incredible progress in knocking down the infection rate of COVID in the last several weeks, Inslee said at a virtual news conference. He did not share news of potential future phases, but said his office will be working on what is coming in, in the coming weeks, monitoring, developing science, and consulting stakeholders. We, we now know that being in lockdown is not working. As you look at states that have been open and states that have been closed over the winter, you can see that there's really no difference in this graph. You can see that Washington State has a low amount of deaths, and when comparing to Utah, you can see that Utah has less and they were open. So is it time for Washington State to remove the mask mandates and ease the mandates related to COVID-19? Is it time to give back control to the counties and the individual? Should we be able to make decisions about our own personal health? Now that Inslee has announced that educators will be vaccinated, should schools be opening fully? Without a clear and present emergency, should the governor still have emergency powers? Let's not renew emergency powers without an emergency. This Saturday, we will host a Constitutional Foundation event and we invite you to come. Without knowledge of our history and our founding documents, tyranny endangers our liberties. Please RSVP at the link below. So this week, we ask that you write your county council members and share with them how you feel about being able to share your screen during open session. Also, ask them how they plan to spend the $200,000 with their social media plan. Are they going to educate the public on COVID-19? Are they going to educate the public on the governor's powers, the emergency powers? Might we just get education on how we can take back the powers and have the, our power in our county, give back the controls to individual counties, and work on our own roadmap to recovery? Keep an eye on the pop-up community support calendar as we have more brave restaurants in need of community support. As always, I ask that you continue to share wewillwalkham.com. Share our stories, share our interviews with small businesses, subscribe at wewillwalkham.com so you can keep up to date with what we're doing. Click the bell below so that you'll be notified every time we create a new video. As always, you can reach out to us, info at wewillwalkham.com. Please, if you have time, share the declaration to open as we all move in an effort to reopen Washington together and safely. Have a great week.